Hey everyone, welcome to the first Battlegrounds Dev Talk for Season 4. This is a new series that we're doing over the course of five videos to show you some of the new content and some insights behind it. I'm Dominic. And I'm Mitchell. And we are game designers on Battlegrounds. This is our largest Battlegrounds update yet, uh, with 58 new minions as well as three returning minions spread across all 10 of our minion types. We're super excited about this update, and we're actually doing something a little bit different this time, where we're going to be rolling them out over multiple days. So at launch on May 9th, you're going to be able to play with six different minion types, but then two days later, as well as on the following Mondays, uh, we're going to be rolling out the remaining four additional types. So that way you're going to get some time to play with each one, understand their new synergies and new tools to work with, uh, and get a firm grasp on it before you get to experience the new content. That's new minions for every minion type. And we've also got a new hero, Rockmaster Voon, which we can check out right now. His hero power upbeat harmony will make a plain copy of your leftmost card every three turns. This is a great way to get an extra copy of that super powerful minion uh, and even get a triple if you have two copies already. One thing that's worth noting on this is that uh, it doesn't actually copy your leftmost minion, it copies your leftmost card which means that you can use it to copy anything. You could copy coins, you could copy blood gems, or even more powerful, you could copy things like Dark Moon Prizes or Triple Rewards to be able to get a lot of additional value out of this hero power. This is actually part of a cycle of new things that are coming, which are upbeat minions. So upbeat minions are, are effects that trigger every X turns. Uh, and a good example of that is Upbeat Duo, which is Battlecry, choose a minion. At the end of every two turns, this gives you a plain copy. Now it's worth knowing this can target minions in the shop as well as your own minions. And it can be really powerful for setting up triples or for setting up really valuable effects like getting a lot of extra Battlecry minions. This one is really fun with Bran because you'll get two copies after two turns for a triple. Uh, and it's also great with a new minion that we're bringing over from Hearthstone called Drakari Enchanter which doubles your end of turn effects. This is also can do a lot of interesting effects if you can multiply its battle cry while it's in play with stuff like the new Disco Shuffler coming to Dragons or with the changes made to Young Murkai. You can get multiple triggers and stack them up. You can golden it and stack them even more. Uh, it's not uncommon to be able to fill your entire hand every turn with this one powerful minion. But the minion itself isn't very big, so you have to decide when you want to cash out and make space to actually have strong stuff in play. Uh, we're also bringing a brand new keyword to Battlegrounds, which is Venomous. So Venomous is our new replacement for Poisonous, and it works very similar, except it's a one-time effect, kind of like Divine Shield. Uh, the first time a minion with Venomous deals damage in each combat, it will destroy the minion to damages. We made this change for a couple of reasons. Poisonous is a really important mechanic in Battlegrounds, because there needs to be ways that you can come back if you're falling behind in stats. It can be pretty demoralizing if my board's really small and I face an opponent with hundreds of stats, it can feel like there's nothing I can do. But with mechanics like Poisonous or Venomous, there is something you can do to compete against an opponent that's outscaling you. But it can also be really frustrating, uh, especially when Poisonous combined with things like Reborn or combined with Divine Shield, it can feel so powerful and it's like the best thing to do and that stats just don't matter anymore. But with Venomous, the stats on the minion continue to matter because after it hits something and loses it, well, it needs to still be relevant and be able to continue to trade. Yeah, Poisonous is a great mechanic for Hearthstone, but in Battlegrounds, we found that minions get a lot more hits in and uh, Divine Shield is a lot more prominent. So we found that Venomous was a good fit. Yeah. We're also making a tweak to an existing keyword, uh, which is Wind Fury. So previously, if you had a Wind Fury minion, say Crackling Cyclone, uh, and you goldened it, the golden version would get Mega Wind Fury. We're now changing it, but the golden version just keeps Wind Fury and no longer gets Mega Wind Fury. Um, we did this for a couple reasons. One, it was a little bit weird that it was the only keyword that, you know, fundamentally changed from dealing two attacks to four attacks when it goldened. But we also made this change because it was really swingy and frustrating, especially when you, the combat starts and you immediately get hit by four attacks. Yeah, nothing feels worse than having four of your minions killed before you even got your first attack. So we're pulling back on that. Yeah. Well, I think that wraps up all the new content for today. Uh, we're really excited for you to check out all of this on May 9th. You'll get to play, and there will be a second dev talk then. And if you want to know more about the new content coming, we also have a blog post up right now where you can go see all of the new minions, as well as a preview event happening tomorrow, May 4th, where you can see some of the new minions in action. See you May 9th. Thanks for watching.